Yeah, I was watching, uh, might not have been out on my bike for the weekend, um, but I was keeping up with uh, the uh, the old YouTube videos. Um, I think I'm pretty much up to date on most of them now. Um, I don't watch all of them, just watch select like, few, but many people have spoken about that, so I'm not going to. Um, yeah, watched one of uh, Tibbs' videos, The Infamous Biker. Um, watched a video that effectively was just um, bullying. <laughs> um, I just think it's to. I can't believe that, well I can believe it because at the end of the day it's uh, human beings that are doing it, um, but yeah, I just, in this day and age with the, the amount of differences that there are within countries, diversity, all stuff like that, I just can't believe how bad bullying is, you know, in the olden days, it was maybe ignored. People used to say, oh, just deal with it, whatever. But it's quite clear how when when people are so badly affected that they don't leave their houses, that they are frightened to go to school, you know, all stuff like that, all because people don't want to or, and probably are scared of. Um, dealing with a bullying situation, and I don't mean I don't mean the victims. I think the victims are scared. Um, for the ones that don't go come forward, I think the victims are quite clearly scared. Um, and that's the whole thing with bullying. I fully understand that. But the people that are supposed to be there to safeguard those people, um, they need to pull their finger out and, and deal with it because. You know, we, we jump on it straight away as soon as somebody uses the word racism. Um, we jump on it as soon as anything like that happens. And we have to deal with it. But people aren't dealing with it because they want to. They're dealing with it because policies tell them they have to. And the only time it's ever going to be sorted is when we move into a position where people are dealing with it because, because they actually believe that it's wrong and people should, people in those situations should have somebody to be able to stand in for them and even if it's show them that they don't have to put up with it, um, however it may be. Um, you know, I, I was bullied at school. Um, coming from a Chinese background, when I was younger, I looked a lot more Chinese than I do now um, and because of that I just got bullied and bullied and bullied um, didn't talk to anybody about it nobody stopped it I used to get stopped in the street and punched um, by people from my school um, it used to happen on the playground nobody ever dealt with it um, and it's just horrendous I, I can't believe, I, I can't abide bullies at all. Um, I've paid the price for stepping in <laughs> a few times. Um, like having a bottle put across the back of my head um, by the person I was sticking up for. Um, when, when they were getting beaten up by their partner, um, whatever medal with us with their marital situations again and see why the police don't bother um, but yeah I just I can't abide bullies really um, I get quite wound up by it but yeah you know people are put in place people should just we shouldn't have anti-bullying policies we should just deal with it it should be the norm it shouldn't be that this person's doing this 
or does it is it in guideline is it in line with the policies that we have to deal with that situation it doesn't make no difference whether you've got a policy or not it, it's just basic basic thoughts is that person being bullied should they be put through that if the answer's no then you deal with it whether you've got a policy to deal with it or not you know the government have the government have all these safeguarding panels and and everything else and they don't even know how to get it right because they're sat there watching policies they're reading policies and trying to follow guidelines at the end of the day if something's wrong you should just deal with it so yeah i suppose this is my utterly first throw um i've tried a couple before and um, not uploaded them um but yeah Happy, uh, happy biking, guys. <laughs>